Karen's father was um, overseas at the time, and uh, whatever the problem with your father was, I, I don't know, but I, I loved the idea of having you kids, and I loved being pregnant with a sciatic nerve, <laughs> and, I, and, I, and I loved having you. That's why we were talking about you. You know, just trying to imagine what it was like for you to have children, to have us. I mean, we ask so many questions now about... And now I really want to understand what it was like for her. I mean, it's different. She got married when she was 20. They didn't have any money. They didn't talk to each other very much. And my father took her to the city as soon as they got married. So she didn't have any friends either. Then, like a month after I was born, he was sent to the Pacific. And a year later, he was dead. I keep trying to know what it was like for my mother to be alone, to have to start a life of her own, to create this life and raise me and my sister Elizabeth. I can't imagine the terror of that. Well, you kids are more truthful. You're, you're um, in better relation to your feelings, really. Mm. You trust them. There's more leeway in the society for you, you know. Mm. But uh, for me, there was such a gap between what I really felt and what I thought, as a woman, I thought I ought to feel that I, I, I could have gone crazy, and a lot of my contemporaries did.